Hey guys, it's Rene. Welcome to this paper candle DIY. This is just an idea that I saw online, loved it, and I wanted to give it a try. Kind of like adding my own twist to it. I'm going to be using this white paper. What I need from this piece of paper is stripes. And for that, I'm going to be just folding this like an accordion. Once I've done that, I'm just going to cut each like piece or stripe. You can cut this with scissors, but I found it easier to just cut it with cutters. Just be real careful when you're doing this and cut it away from you. Once I have done that and I have a bunch of like stripes, I'm going to be using two per candle and some double-sided tape. I'm going to be cutting a small piece of tape and I'm just going to be taping both of those stripes like this, making a kind of like UV right there. And I'm just going to fold the bottom stripe of paper like on top of the other stripe of paper. I'm just going to let you watch instead of like trying to explain what I'm doing. So once I reached the end though, I'm just going to be adding another piece of double-sided tape and I'm just going to tape the whole thing. We can open this and this is the shape that we have right now. And this is going to be the bottom part, the wax part we could say of the candle. As far as for the flame goes, I'm going to be using yellow and red paper. First I'm going to start with the red paper and I'm just going to fold it once. I'm going to cut it and then I'm going to cut a bunch of like these shapes. I don't really know how to call them. Just make sure that you cut the part on the bottom. The same for the yellow part. I'm going to be folding that and then just cutting it. Basically doing the same thing, but in this case, I'm just not going to be leaving the part on the bottom. I'm just going to be attaching those with some double-sided tape. Once I have done all that, I'm just going to be adding more double-sided tape and I'm just going to be, well, taping that part on the top in there. And then I'm just going to be adding some dimension here or something else because it looked kind of weird. I'm just going to be taking orange marker and I'm just going to be adding a line because I'm going to be using them as cupcake decorations. I'm going to be adding a toothpick like so on the bottom part and just be careful if you do this. I happen to poke myself with my toothpick on my fingers and it kind of like hurts so yeah just keep that in mind and just be careful this is an extra step you don't have to do it if you don't want to so i just went ahead and painted the parts that were showing through and don't worry my cupcake is not gonna touch the toothpick like this part of the toothpick as far as my cupcakes i do have the recipe that i do for this and i'm using some buttercream i do have the recipe as well with my wilton 2d and i added some sprinkles i'm just going to be adding those toppers and this is why I used a toothpick to just make this easier. And yeah, this is the idea that I wanted to share. It's a cute alternative for birthday candles. Something fun that you can have next to a birthday cake or if you just want to go for this. I think they look super cute and unique. It's different. They are affordable, handy and easy to make. They add something extra as well. So if you like this, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more stuff. I upload twice a week. Click on the bell and share as well. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys.